Okay, everybody, this is the transformation process for Shadow Striker from Legacy Evolution. Just to remind, it is only this transformation process. The review is separately uploaded. Now, to be honest, it actually does make it easier to attach the roof to the, well, to her, I was going to say to the forearm, but it's her right forearm. It's just easier to attach that, and it helps you keep track of where everything is, actually, to be honest. So what you want to do first and foremost, then, is get the back, separate it via a tab, and then fold it all the way up like so that's gone straight up in the air then what we can do is we can lift up these parts like so so we've lifted them up then you can take what's the shoulders and then bring these around so just separate via that tab bring these around and you've got the arms facing down up there you can't that's it so that's what you're looking like then if we turn our attention to this part where the chest is what you're going to do you're going to lift this up fold out the front like so there's a little tab underneath there which, sorry, a little purple part, which has got a tab on it, so you can bend it back and that will lift this forward, bring that up as well. Now, if we turn our attention to the back, fold the heels uh, down, so the toes from the front are going into the shins. Now, at the back, there is tabs there, which is what's gonna go into this cutout there. So take the leg all the way up. As you take it up, what you're looking to do is tab that in as well at the same time. So you can see what I just did there. This is gonna come up. If I move it out ever so slightly, you can see that this one is going to tab, oops, into there as well. He says, now he just missed it. You can see that's better. That's gone in and that's gone in. Now also at the back, there's a tab there and the same on the other side and there's another cutout on the foot so if we just line this up it's a great transformation process to be honest and everything does line itself all up and it looks really good i think that's gone in if i if it hasn't i can correct it in a second you can also see now that there's tabs here for the forearms to go into as well it really is just a case of piecing it all together once you've done that so hold on to the legs to make sure they pop in for some reason typically that's better. Now it's gone in. Now you've got a cut out there. Now you've got a tab on the door so you can bring this over. You can close that and we can do the same on this side. I'll bring this down in a minute. It's a little more awkward because you've got the roof part. Bring this over, tab that in. OK, now grab the front, bring this over and you can hear and see how you just snap that down into position. Right. This is the only really tricky bit and it is the home stretch. So what you need to do is hold the forearm down allow this to fold over itself and then it's just a case of you can see the tabs on the back there and the tabs underneath it's just a case of lining these all up clipping them all in like so and then on the back you've got two tabs there two cutouts either side of that you can line this up and tab that in as well and there's your alternate mode okay then so let's transform her back to her robot mode so you need to disconnect everything and of course take off the back part which you've put on and then carefully just disconnect the roof ever so slightly then you can lift the forearms up a little bit then you can disconnect the doors like so then what we need to do is go to the front so disconnect the whole front part lift this up and over around what is of course going to be the tops um, of her thighs etc lift this up now carefully disconnect this bit at the back now don't pull too hard because you need to separate the little tab that's in there as well so you can do it at the same time pull and push back so separate from here and then take off that tab there as well bring the legs all the way down turn the feet completely flat turn your attention to the midsection fold these all the way up Fold this little section as well all the way up so fold it all the way back just like that that's now of course going to be the midsection then with regards to the arms and the shoulders take the wheels so if i show you this turn it this way around fold these back like so this will tab into position like so back into position like so then you're going to collapse this down over the back of her and there's a huge tab there going to tab back in itself like so once you've done that that's pretty much it to be honest you can adjust in the positions put them wherever you want but there you go that's your transformation process hope it helped take care